Hi, this is Thomas from Blocky.io again, and now this is part two of the video of how uh, I'm showing you how to parallelize uh, the processing of your data in Blocky. In the earlier video, we looked at how to do that uh, in a multi-threaded fashion. So it was still run within the same machine. And now we're going to see how we can do it in a distributed fashion to have it uh, parallelized over uh, many machines. And it's really quite easy. Uh, so this is uh, our sub, uh, sub network is doing the actual work. So we're going to move that to, uh, we're going to move this to be in its own service. And uh, it's very easy, it's just to have a public entry connected there. We'll give it a name, which is going to call it map. And this could be, could be within its own, uh, its own canvas like this, but uh, usually that is what you would do. But I'm going to keep it on the same canvas here because so we can see everything easier. Right. So then we need a public send here. So this will actually send the work to be done to some other service. And it's the same user running both services, so we don't need any special permissions to going uh, cross service borders here. Um, so I'm going to save this. I'm going to start it. And yeah, here is our C URL command. Yeah, so I'm going to run this now, and you can see that this takes one second. And that is because this is running parallel. So if I change this back to be running in, uh, in serial mode, uh, this is gonna take uh, three seconds. So what actually happens here is that this is uh, can be instantiated on many machines. So the work that is sent out from here uh, will be evenly distributed over how many instances there might be of this. And that is more or less up to Blocky to decide how many instances it's gonna start. So uh, yeah, this is really similar to the to the previous, uh, previous video. But if I start this now, um, we can see if I pause this here, now we have some flows. We have three flows here. So I'm gonna be sending out one. So this one counts here to our new, our kind of external service. So we can send in, just step in, step in these uh, these messages here. Yeah, so I'm, I'm just gonna step these. So if there would have been three instances of this, uh, it will have been uh, one one flow on each instance. So yeah, stepping, 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 stepping. Yeah, it's coming. It's coming back here out to the map block. Yeah, very similar to the last example uh, when we were multi-threading. But now the difference is that uh, this is a distributed. Uh, parallelization so there there we get our data back right so this was how to uh, 
change your service to uh, operate in a distributed manner instead of a, in a multi-threaded manner. Very, very simple. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching this and remember if you like it uh, head over to our Indiegogo crowdfunding campaign at indiegogo.com and back us. It's open until the end of 2013. Thanks.